buddy. It's uh, Newark Malamores versus the Charleston Chestnuts. It's week two right now. Final game week two, perhaps. Second to last. I'm here with Aiden's Halo. What's up? And then, of course, Tottenham. Halo. What's up, man? Yo, yo. All right. What, what do y'all think of this matchup? You like the teens? Like uh, the Malamars, go Burr. Mal- <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Chalk it up. Chalk it up. <laughs> Not much else you could say. <laughs> there you go. I haven't really paid much attention to this matchup, um, so I'm definitely going to lean on Aiden on what he thinks for this matchup, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. We've got two two good opponents, so it should be a good game. I mean, when you got Glow King, you got Landorus, you got Val, you got Bax. I mean, like, what else do you need? Fair, fair. I am, uh... That's nothing wants to work for me. Right now, just freaking out. I can stream it if you need. No, 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 no. I got that. It's just like, oh, we're good though. It's okay. Okay. As long as it gets me, you. gets us talking, and it has some, and it has, it has you guys feel the talking, we're good. The okay. Valley Winnie the Voodoo. Yeah, check what out the nicknames. Mean? What? what uh, Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the. How does that like, look? It's Winnie the Voodoo. Because it's like you know. Uh, in the yeah. uh, Scarlet and Violet games, this uh, Ursaloon is like, oh, it only comes out at night, and it's all oh, weird okay. and looks different. And I see, yeah, I, see. I get it. All right, that's cool. That's a good nickname. No nicknames though on the other side, unfortunately. But we'll see. There could be some more nicknames. Sorry. Busy. Yeah, you're good, you're good. So, Aiden, in the Pickums, you said you had the, uh, what was it, the Valiant Steam coming out? Oh, yeah. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> um, I mean, I don't think it's going to be a 6-0, but I think it's probably going to be pretty bad. Okay, okay. For Charleston's side. Not, not saying that he's not a good player, it's just who will, whoever allowed this Malamar's team to be a real team mm-hmm. should be fired from <laughs> the league from anything that matters oh there my is. Oh, goodness okay. all right <laughs> there it is. well Got him. i think he just wanted to rain up honestly in that situation um but i also don't own the calcs so i mean to be fair i don't think he really had anything that wanted to really switch into a close combat maybe rodham but not really yeah i mean maybe sneezler because, like, I don't know what Grass CC does. I don't know what it boosts. But at the same time, it also didn't want to switch into a Psychic move. But here we go. Here's no Unburden. No Grass CC? Hold it on. Be fake on might be, yeah, I would say Normal Jam is a very popular one. I think it's Scarf. Well, it's a good U-turn. Pick up some momentum. Get the Voodoo back in. What? Take advantage of the Grassy Terrain. And so just go for a straight favor. blood moon. Yep, forty percent. Not as much as he'd like, but nah, it's definitely not. Especially in the grassy terrain, not enough. So, if you're on the side of Charleston, what would you recommend them to do right now, Aiden? He's uh, trying to try to pick up this win. Yeah, dude. Uh, right. go rot, wash, probably. Um, but even then, there's not a good situation with that Rillaboom gone. I just don't think he has many defensive answers to anything on his team, especially with, like, this Primarina sitting here. Yeah, there's not much, honestly. I didn't even know he had Diancy. Oh. I think that one of the best bets is to get Lando T dead, uh, so he can just full switch out on everything. But we'll see how that goes. Mm. Yeah. I mean, the problem I feel like right now is whenever that, whenever that Val comes in, I mean, it's looking like it's claiming something. It's taking something before it leaves. <laughs> okay, we're taking the hits. We're, ooh. Nice, okay. okay. All mine. With Good the play. terrain, okay, this? Ooh. Oof. Yeah, to okay. be fair, I thought they was going to do that the first turn. Um, but okay, that's nice, that's nice. Hey, he's still, he might... I don't think he can. I think. He, ooh, I don't. Mm, is this a losing battle? It feels like a losing battle. Uh, probably. Well, how much, He's going to have. Yeah. 53. Surf 53 to 63. With yeah, this the is. The that I have. He has to keep yeah. spending moonlight. 
Oh, knows, wow. He needed the yep, terrain to live, he's right? Yeah, uh, yeah, spin cycle, uh, surf. I don't think... Yeah, it, here's what should have happened. Is this specs? Is this specs? On, I think. It might be specs. No, it can't be because it changed no. from... Um, it changed from Moonblast to surf. Oh. That was a good volt switch. Back into Ursa Luna. This is his best bet to set up Calm Mines right here. Hope for a para on a chili or something. Or just straight Val. Okay, well, here we go. At least he gets health back. That's what he needs. I'm saying whenever this thing comes in, it's leaving with something. It, but yeah, now something dies probably. Look at look at the fighting weakness. Covalian, Diancy. Well, Diancy's resisted, but... Yeah. Nothing wants to take a hit from Val. Yeah. Um, Sneasler dies to a Psy Shock. I don't think it's Psy Shock. It's physical. Yeah, it takes a CC. It takes one. Oh if this thing Lord. is Scarf... Then it comes out with a poison jab, probably. I don't. If it if it has fake out, it's not scarfed. But let's find it's, out. It's well, it's it most definitely shown not it. scarfed. Yeah, it hasn't shown the fake out, so the scarf is looking quite likely. The fact that he's willing to use it on that valiant probably scream scarf. He needs the blood. He he needs to calm mind here. Um, he 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 can calm yeah, mind calm and then calm mind again. It is calm mind will be free here. Utom won't do much. Only he could three, also so. he could also straight up Blood Moon. It says it kills the Lando. He could, and but... it could pick up a kill on something else other than Slow King. But even then, potentially. Yeah. Well, the, okay. Well, Marina. Okay, he, he went into Pre Marina. I was gonna say if he calm mind switches, he could have went back into Valiant potentially, protecting the calm mind and CC, but. Good play. Back into Good play. Lando with the Intimidate, T-Wave. T-Wave. Uh, Showing his hand. I think clicking Blood Moon was probably the best bet there. Wait a minute. Gravity. We got quite the interesting match going on, guys. Live join from Yamar favorite. Uh, the Mug. I just dropped Sunday in on you guys, you know. Where are we dropping? Few of recording. <laughs> Gravity. Now that's a new one. Yeah. I never knew it set up a room looking thing. No, I didn't know that either. It does. Man nice just turned the world room. green. Mm. Oh, what? Ooh. But why does he want to sack this? He can T wave it more things. He doesn't do anything to the rest of his team, I'm going to be honest. He can T wave more things. He can T wave. He really needs Lando gone so he can Volt Switch and T wave. But alas, it's not one health, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. Mm. I'm gonna be honest, I don't really know if T-Wave does much um, into the rest of his team, but... Finally gets a special defense drop, no doesn't matter. I'm yeah. curious on the no U-turn. Maybe now they're just trying to kill off Lando, I guess, but I feel like U-turn to conserve and intimidate for later would be useful. Blood Moon, please. Especially on that Sneasler, yeah. Blood Moon, calm mind, please don't let me know if Lando does have anything to really hit it hard. It, was it like, like defensive Lando? With a U-turn grab? Or? Um, yeah, probably. And with special defense say three queens. How, what, what do yep. you think of the battle so far? Because obviously you've just joined. What is your opinion uh, on it? I've been watching. I feel like um, there was a bit of like um, posturing around like the Ursa Luna and Marina plus uh, Slow King nope. earlier. Oh, There's no, Blood Moon. Doesn't Blood Moon. Kill. I think this Marina has to be an AV um, just by the way the damage is being dealt. And sure. no, no Calm Mind. Kind of weird. Citrus, okay. Citrus. Well, can't Calm Mind if there's uh, AV. Oh, you mean on the uh, the, blood the blood moon? moon. I yeah. think yeah. Just on the switch in, you know, live a surf. You know, maybe you can live something else. I don't know. Glow King's well, parrot. So I don't know. I think Don is definitely playing the black foot. Like I think he's trying not to get six out, let alone anything else at this I point. I think he was on the back foot from the start of the prep. If I'm going to be <laughs> real on it. <laughs> Shouts out, yeah. New York. <laughs> Malamar's team is quite disgusting. Whoever let this thing be is not, not in the right mind. Hey, I'm definitely interested in um, later on as the season goes to see how like Malamar stacks against someone like Lopunnies or Agrons or Klefkis, right? Like that's going to be a very fun battle to watch. Well, I, I was talking to him during se the during when he lost season three. He lost to Ben. Um, now he, he is a bodybuilder, so he does competitions a lot where he's from. So he mm -hmm. said his focus he's was a on bodybuilder? yeah. Day. He says he focuses on bodybuilding during seasons three and four so mm -hmm. he didn't really you know put his all attention to pokemon but now he says like oh it season's over he says now nah, i'm ready i said okay 
Ooh, okay. Like I said, that man's on his revenge tour. <laughs> okay. yeah. um, I will say, yeah. I uh, I talked to him a little bit for prepping for my battle, and he he's so insightful. Like he he, he yeah. he's cooking on something. Mm -hmm. he's cooking. Boy, After cooking. he beat Abbotsford, I believe, season three, to stop him from going into feet back to back. <laughs> him and I hopped in the call. We talked for like an hour, and I was like, oh, this dude knows a lot more than what he lets on. <laughs> <laughs> hey. That's Sun Tzu right there. You got you got to be <laughs> yeah, when, when you know a lot. Play dumb. <laughs> <laughs> that man's been reading Sun Tzu. Is that the is that the art of war? That him? It is the art of oh, war. Yeah. It, it's the art of Pokemon. The art of Pokemon. Someone go write that. <laughs> <laughs> Where is? It's right. a blood moon. Know. Okay. Out. Okay. I like this. Don't freeze. Imagine no freeze. freeze. No freeze. Okay, we like it. Okay. Imagine freeze. This sloking is such a huge scapegoat for Ursaluna. It's just letting Ursaluna just come back in, heal, come back in, heal, like whenever it takes damage. Yeah. Thing is, then the Val comes out and then it forces the the Blood Moon out as long as it doesn't yep. switch in on a Blood Moon. Okay. No oh, combine again. Looked, yeah. Pause. I think I know is... Yeah, I think you sack Sloking right now to get Valiant in, and then you kind of just go hard. Yeah, that makes sense. I think you're at the point now where differential be damned. You just need to get Valiant in to get uh, Sneasler, out of the game. Sneasler can't take another hit. Diancy, even though it can be physically defensive, I don't think it really wants to take a CC. I think it dies in two, um, probably. I think yeah. it's probably what, Choice Band or something? Like something crazy. It the has to be because the damage is crazy. CC, yeah. Ouch. yeah. That Sneasler's Scarf, though, We I think we've yep. decided. So Is that free kills now for the Val? Uh, yeah. No. Uh, yes. Lando. No, Lando got the kill on the Cabalion. Cabalion. On the Cabalion. Okay, there we go. But either way, this thing's not for damage. Well, he just still has another Intimidate double. Mon. Actually, mm -hmm. that's right. Double Intimidate with. Dude, this is. Gross. Double Intimidate regen backs. Ah, this is. Who allowed the. Oh, my goodness. Oh. oh. Back into Val. Maybe actually, it Did can hit with a fair. Oh, 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 weakness policy. No, wait, oh, the set spikes. He didn't do okay, a well. like diamond storm or like setup. Oh, that's really. That was, oh, wow. That was it. Mm. My guess is he's setting up for this blood moon to do something, but I don't know. <laughs> I mean, if the valiant was lower, maybe these hazards could play could play a game. But now with that dancing on though, left. this this valiant just. Yeah. Comes in and or backs, I guess, with boots. Backs boots. Yeah. The game is over. Yeah. I think Ice Shard might kill as well on that Sneasler. Diancy gets agility. Probably... You should go agility, Diancy with Ooh. Glaive Rush. That might not have. I don't know. I don't. Tanky be... backs. Might be scarf backs even. I don't know. Mm. Could be scarf. Tower, scarf. I'll like speed the Sneasler. Oh, it never outspeeds the Sneezer if it's Scarfed. Never? There's no way. Yeah, you need nope. the Ice Shard. Speed, to... tiers, speed oh. tiers are real bad on backs. That's why it runs Dragon Dance a lot. Speed tiers be damned. Even All Scale right, well. Shot if you're crazy. Yeah. yeah. Bex has like base 87 speed and Sneezer has like base, I want to say, like in the 120s. 120s? Yeah, 120s, 130s. So if you wanted to outspeed a Sneezer, you'd have to be max speed Jolly. Scarf backs and have the Sneasler not get unburdened or have Scarf or anything like that. Jesus. There's yep, a shard. There's, there's a shard. All right. All right. GG. GG. Not a 6 0. So. Not a 6 0. That's nope. what matters. That's what matters. That's what matters. Yeah. That's what matters. I mean, he did damage to the rest of his team. It's just. It, they just positioned well, you know? Yep. Not a 6 0. That's what matters. True. True. <laughs> Very true. No, oh, that was a good game. I mean, even Don, like, even though he was on the back foot, he was still making right plays. He was pivoting around Ursaluna. The times you think that, oh, Ursaluna's out of the game now. Nope, he was able to find ways to bring him back in, back to full health. Like, Don still played a really good game. I think he should be pretty happy with it. Like, yes, the the it is a 5-0, but when you're... I, I think that's more to say on Malamar's part more so than Chestnut's, right? Like, I don't yeah. think this is more of a Chestnut blunder more than uh, Malamar's, yeah, like, I agree. strength. Well, well that's I know it. who's number one at next week's. Yeah, that's, that's that's the easy one. That's it from there us, and we're gonna go right into your match. 
Pungside. Yep. All right. We'll oh, see you on the next one. Oh, bye bye. Yeah.